So you just got your new ASUS Tough Gaming Laptop and you're wondering how do I control the RGB on the keyboard? In today's video, I'm going to show you what you can and cannot do with your Tough Gaming Laptop. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Right guys, to get set up on your ASUS Tough Gaming Laptop with RGB, you would actually need to download a few things. First, you need to check if you have Armory Crate software. It's right here. And then if you have additional RGB components, such as an RGB mouse, headphones, or something like that, you will also need Aura Creator to create effects for your RGB. But if you just have the laptop, skip the Aura Creator and download Armory Crate. How to download Armory Crate? Just open Google Chrome, search your model number on Google. My model is FX506HM. You can find your model number right here if you type in system information on your start menu. And then if you go to system model, you will see mine is an ASUS Tough Gaming F15 FX506HM. And you can see the rest of the specs here. Once you have the model, you just scroll down to see the ASUS website and click on the support FX506HM. Then you click on driver and utility. You can also see if there are any BIOS updates, which I'm not going to do in this video. Select your OS, I'm running Windows 11. Scroll down and go to Software and Utility. That's where you'll see ASUS System Control Interface. Download that. Click on Show All. As well as you'll need Armory Crate and Aura Creator Installer. So download that by clicking here and here. Install both of those. Restart your PC and come back to the desktop. All right, I've done that. I'm back at the desktop. Now you can go to Start and type Armory Crate. Let it load. It will allow you to control your fans, your performance, or you can monitor your temperatures. That's all secondary. What we need to do is go to this screen here, Aura Sync. We can see our FX506 is here. And then if we hit play, we can set the device lighting right here. So right now you can see it is set to color cycle. But if you see my camera that is recording the actual laptop, the color cycle is not happening. If that's the case, you need to press FN plus the keyboard lighting controls up here to light up your keyboard. This is max keyboard brightness. And you can see the RGB is going up. Cycling colors. Now, if you don't like the color cycle, you can set it to strobe, a certain color you like, white. There you go, that looks cool. You can make it pink, blue, whatever you like. Yellow also looks cool in my opinion. I'm gonna leave it at that. Yeah, there's also breathing. If you go to breathing, you can set the breathing speed and brightness. So you can set to really slow breathe. There you go, we got orange breathe going on. And you can also set it to static for your regular boring mode. Set it to something snazzy. There you go. Looks pretty cool. Now what if you wanted to sync it to your music? Can it be done? Let's check Armory Crate if it allows us to do that. So there are no options here, but there is a hidden option somewhere here. Scenario Profiles, Profile 1, and then if you go to Aura Sync, and then you can select Music. Does it work here? I don't know. Let's play some music, see if that works. Post Device Lighting Effect right. Let's see if we can apply this profile to a certain app. I'm going to find out Google Chrome because that's where I play my music. So let's select that, save, go to Google Chrome. So by default, I don't think Aura Sync or Asus Armory Crate allows you to sync your keyboard lights to music for some reason. Although it does support Hue connection, which I do have, uh, Philips Hue just right there. There you go has been added so yeah um the laptop cannot be selected for aura effect so again a bit disappointed to be honest that you cannot sync your uh, laptop rgb to whatever you're playing on the laptop so you might be able to do it with a third party software as provided from asus you can see there's clearly a yellow sign here that says you can't use this device for aura sync although if you do have a mouse or a gaming headset you can download aura creator and that will let you create custom RGB effects that span through your room. You can click here and select any of the devices that you have. I don't have any ASUS or Sync compatible devices, so, but yeah, 
that's how you RGB your laptop. And there you have it guys, that's how you get your RGB going to exactly how you want it, especially with the modes that ASUS allowed, which are four modes. And smash that like button if this video helps you configure your RGB. Consider subscribing and dinging that notification bell just down there. Check out my other videos right up here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.